look at how they're preparing. Marvin? Yeah, take a look at this truck you see right here. This is new here at the West Lafayette Street Department. And if you squint behind me, you can see that there's another one just like it. The department is already tuning up these trucks for the winter. Superintendent Ben Anderson says they'll be prepared. Winter is coming, and when it does, the West Lafayette Street Department will be ready. It just helps. I mean, it, it just gives us more peace of mind to be able to know that we're going to be able to get the job done. Superintendent Ben Anderson says the department has added a few new weapons to its arsenal. We've uh, added a couple trucks with wing plows on there to allow us to do uh, more with, uh, with the personnel that we have. The department also welcomed a new 9,600 square foot garage in June. It holds 12 trucks and also has a radiant heat floor system that will keep the trucks defrosted. It was five years in the making uh, to get this building built. Um, same thing with the expansion as, as the city has grown. We were had outgrown the salt barn that was built in 94. Attached to the new building is an automated brine maker. The um, brine maker and the ability to make brine faster than we can put it out is huge. Uh, we could put it out way faster than we could make it. Anderson says it takes 12,000 gallons to pre treat city streets. The brine maker makes 4,500 gallons in 30 minutes. That's compared to the 2,500 gallons they'd make in a day. The ability to be able to stay up with no matter what's happening outside. Uh, again, another small thing for us to alleviate. Uh, stress. The department is also the first in the state to own a multi hog, a piece of equipment that will help the department service nearly 70 cul de sacs in the city. It'll do about seven different jobs for us, but it also has the capability of plowing snow. We're here to serve, and we enjoy doing that, and eliminating those small things that make a little bit easier, a little bit more comfortable, a little bit less ben stressful. Anderson says they try to bring in a new truck like this one you see here every year. He says the department is about four years away from having all new updated trucks. In West Lafayette, Marvin Bills, News 18. All right, good to know. Thank you, Marvin. And